you just pose one for them for the Coast Guard magazine? And also the president, he can be congratulating you. I, all right. That's right. You have to stand there. How's that? All right. That's all a right. pleasure. I'm happy to do that. I'm the organizer. An old program. baseball man. <laughs> I'm, uh, I mean, it's a great joy to do that. I'm an old baseball nut myself. Well, hey. <laughs> I, and then I, last night I was using an example in a few words over there about the baseball player, and I found myself talking about Bob Feller. And I had to stop and say, I know I have now <laughs> aged myself. <laughs> Great baseball, I think. Yeah. Well, I, I go back to when Ted Williams was my hero when he was first starting in Boston. So oh, that's, well, listen, so I, we're in the I, same era. I, I think of the same thing. I was broadcasting baseball back in the, in the early 30s. Yes, I recall. Yeah. Yeah. That's marvelous. Well, just the other day, uh, to bring it to the modern days, Mr. President, we had a group of our young cadets down here, all female for a change, who are uh, uh, sculling one of our shells in, uh, in uh, races all over the place, and they're just doing a wonderful job. Well, is that right? Can they compete with the men's crews? Or no, the at least not yet. They're, they're, they're kind of keeping them uh, uh, separate uh, as far okay. as uh, moving. Do you have what you why don't we? Uh, why don't we take almost a year and a half of you, Mr. President? Uh, I, I thoroughly enjoyed my service under you, and uh, my time is just about over. Well, believe it or not, Mr. President, he's going to retire to Alaska. Right? Can you imagine that? To Alaska? <laughs> yes, sir. Anchorage, Alaska. Isn't that great? You know, a Californian having spent a winter, one winter already in, in, in half of the other in, in Washington. No, I'm going to be like, you prefer to go to the Sandy Beach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I understand that. <laughs> well, I can relate to that. I just finished three years in San Francisco. and. Uh, when the first winter came, uh, snow came this year, I called up and said, all is forgiven, can I come back? <laughs> <laughs> I'm hooked, I'm going to go to California when it's my yeah. time. Yeah, of course, San Francisco, the Southern Californians think even that's too cold. That's true. But as an old... Uh, see you. They belong to us. There are, there yeah. are aircraft yeah. coming. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well, well, listen, we got television cameras. It's something new in here. Yeah, yeah that's kind of really neat. That's a directional mic. Uh, yeah. Always make me a little nervous. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Over there. Sure. sure. Thank you, sir. That was quite a party we had on my St. Pat's Day. Remember that uh, speech by the Prime Minister of Nancy? The, which one? St. Patty's Day. Oh, oh, oh yes. Yeah. 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 Nancy said to tell you she tried to catch your eye and couldn't catch your eye <laughs> during the lunch. I was a great defender of the That was a beautiful close, wasn't it, Mr. I tell you, the, uh, that's been a, listen, I had to go ahead and I, I ordered and I decided, and I hope I'm not wrong, but everybody likes meatloaf, so they had meatloaf in the end, and I ordered meatloaf. We're allowed to eat that on Fridays nowadays. Oh, good Lord. You know, our rules changed about 15 or 20 years ago. <laughs> that's right, <laughs> yes. Thank heaven, because I hadn't even thought about it being Friday. And, oh, yeah. Well, I'm glad. How are you doing? Pretty well? Uh, well, till I think about the Congress and the budget. <laughs>